Hello, Gump Town. Today we're at the Montgomery Chamber Diversity Summit downtown at the Renaissance Hotel. And today we're here with Joe Gerstan, um, diversity and inclusion speaker, and he was the opening keynote speaker for today. How are you doing this morning? I'm good. How are you? Now tell us about your message that you gave this morning. So I, I did a presentation this morning on understanding unconscious bias or unintentional bias. Mm -hmm. um, there's a fair amount of research that says even if we have very good intentions, very inclusive, welcoming intentions, mm -hmm. there's, we still have some very strong tendencies to be naturally judgmental, to jump to conclusions, to make assumptions. And I think that understanding that helps us do a better job of, of reducing the impact of bias rather than pretending that it doesn't exist. Okay, and uh, what types of um, effect can um, unconscious bias have in the workplace as far as decision making, like hiring or firing right. or whatnot? Well, I think hiring and firing, especially hiring, is, is a, a big opportunity for unconscious bias to play a role, and I think that it very easily can compromise those decisions. Um, and I think some of the examples that I shared about how um, regarding heights and weight and mm -hmm. race and age and some of those things showed that our decision making isn't quite as accurate as it could be. We, we look at things and we interpret it and we give it meaning and we oftentimes end up making decisions about people based on fact, excuse me, based on fiction rather than fact. Okay, and last question, why is it that diversity summit or programs like this important? to the business community? Well, I think it's important for a bunch of different reasons, but, but directly it's an opportunity for people from different organizations and different parts of this community to come together and get information and get resources and get tools that they can take back to their work or where they live and make it a more inclusive place, making sure that people are fully able to participate and belong wherever they work and live and play. So I think it has a lot of benefits. All right. Thank you so much, Joe, for this interview. And um, you're tuning in to Guntown TV. Stay connected. Thank you.